it today and those online you are welcome to word on fire ministry the bible says that just shall live shall by faith amen whatever is happening here i believe is happening in your homes amen. hallelujah amen again Thank today you, god said i should preach if i don't preach this word today i will be in serious trouble mercy lord Mercy. While you go home and you are eating a bar and a goosey soup, I will be I'll be explaining myself why I did not teach. When I say that, she's always happy. <laughs> she always comes to me and like the word, the word, the word. Hallelujah. Amen. Going back to the ABCs of Christianity. Amen. Many times it's not the big things you need, it's the small things you need. Thank you, Jesus. Before you ask for the hand of God, check your character check yourself that is what he is ready to teach us today quickly in this month of breaking limitation we have already established that limitations are blockages stopping an individual to go beyond a particular level in life and in destiny and we have been looking at self-imposed limitations for those who are not here last week we said that every time god senses a limitation it hinders god Every time God senses a limitation, God is disappointed. Every time God senses a limitation, it's like it ties the hand of God from releasing what he has already right. ordained for that individual yes. and for that family. For you, hearing the sound of my voice, yeah. that limitation that has held you all this year, it is broken by fire. Amen. It is broken by fire. Amen. If you are a man, it's like that you are the one I came for. Sit down, please. And we said that every time God senses your limitation, he's disappointed because God is able to do exceedingly, abundantly, above, far beyond what you can think or imagine. Amen. Exceeding. Exceeding abundantly. Yeah far beyond so what you are thinking now that that's what he wants to do for you this year that's not what he's thinking it's higher. <laughs> what he's thinking amen. is far beyond above exceedingly Sitting. what you are thinking amen, amen. shout hallelujah hallelujah number one we said self-imposed limitation we looked at is familiarity familiarity with the grace speaking for you familiarity with the grace speaking for you Again, we said the grace you don't celebrate cannot truly work with you. You know what God told me? He said, son, they don't need a touch. They need a word that will go straight in their heart. Amen. Amen. Say, son, they don't need a conference. They need a word that will go straight in their heart. Amen. 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 Number two, we said it's the self limitation we looked at number two we looked at that last week was you must be able to say the right things you must be able to say the right things you must be able to say what the, the right, right things. things job 6 25 27 how possible are the right words look at that but what does your arguing reproof he said do you imagine to reprove words and the speeches of one that is desperate which are as a wind. wind say the right words every time you refuse to say the right word in faith you limit yourself Mercy and you God. limit the move of god in yes. your life in your generation and in this service today the tell limitation we place on ourselves is a lack of image formation a lack of image formation if that is word is too hard for you imagination Imagination. imagination what did you imagine will happen in this service today what did you imagine god will do in this service for you and your family today mm. many of us we imagine the dress we wear we imagine the levels of the foundation the layers one two three layers some of you four layers some of you five layers you imagine that foundation on your face but one thing god said to me son that has been the limit of their life is that they don't have an image of what i'm about to do in the services am i, am I making any sense here yes sir when you go to a chinese restaurant you imagine the food you're going to eat mm. but it's only when we come to church that we only imagine how that dress will fit us we only imagine looking ourselves in the mirror for three hours but i have not prayed for three minutes Mercy, Lord. for what we are to expect in mm. the service jesus 
Say, son, that is how they have limited me. Mm. Because they come with no expectation. They come with no imagination. Mm. They come with no image of what I'm about to do in the service. Oh, sir, you God. are from Dubai. That is why in Dubai, sir, I can tell you that an architect went out of his way and began to create buildings under the water. Amen. Sir, as soon as he saw an image of the building he wanted to build, the bricklayers, the carpenter, they must all produce Amen. that image. Amen. Image imagination. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, sir. Proverbs 16, 1. Look at this. The preparation of the heart is the responsibility of man. That's right. And the answer sir, of, the, of tongue the tongue is from, the, from Lord. the Lord. Amen. The answer is from the Lord. From Kenneth? No, sir. From man? No, sir. The answer is from the Lord. But the preparation is the responsibility of Tuan. Mm -hmm. But the answer is from the Lord. Nobody can prepare a heart for you. No song can prepare a heart for you. You must take personal responsibility to prepare your own heart to receive from the Lord. That's right. Amen. And if you came here to see me, then you missed it. Because the answer is from the Lord. Amen. Now don't get me wrong. Through the verses of God are those whom he uses to bring about the answer. That's right. But the answer is not from them. No, sir. The answer is from heaven. The most high. Thank you, Jesus. Looking up to Jesus, the author and, and the, the finisher, finisher of your faith. Of faith. Amen. If you came to see a friend, then you did not come well. That's right. If you came to look at the dress of your neighbor, then you have just missed it. That's right. The people meet at various places to chat. No, yes, sir. No, here, sir. here is serious business. Hey, hey, my father. We meet here to change destinies. We meet here Preach to on, take sir. keys in the realm of the spirit. Thank you, Holy Ghost. To open doors and patterns that have held us the family. That's right. Here is serious business, sir. Amen. Sit down, sir. Thank you, Jesus. So therefore, that literally means that the preparation of your heart to receive is your responsibility. Your personal responsibility. But the answer comes from heaven and not through any man. The man is only the vessel that God wants to use to set up the stage for you to align yourself to receive your answers. Amen. Media, please, tie to this message. The answers are from heaven. Child of God, the Bible says, Proverbs 16, 1. The preparation of the heart is for man. But the answer of the tongue is from the Lord. Yes, it is true that the answers will come from open heavens, according to scriptures. But our hearts must be prepared to receive. Now, I'll teach you some things that you sing and you wave your hands and you cry and you fall and the anointing is on you does not mean your heart is prepared. That's right. <laughs> That you yield and you cry and there are tears does not mean your heart is prepared. prepared to receive. That's right. Some people can fall because of emotion. Mm. Michael Jackson made people fall. Thank you, Jesus. Shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. And I'm not directing this message at anyone because the way you guys are looking at me. <laughs> hallelujah. I'm talking to my own self the Lord began to show me that unfortunately most times when the heavens are open in the service like during the worship today That's to right. vomit miracles to vomit breakthroughs mm. some people are standing like Mount Zion that cannot be moved some people are watch, looking at their Facebook page some people are looking at their shoe whether it is still polished Mercy, some people Lord. are looking how fine their suit is Mercy. some people are checking their makeup is the mascara is about to come out that is when the miracle and heaven has been released and that is how we miss it mercy lord look i was in the office i was impacted by this service i went down my knees and i was praying there for almost 20 minutes in the office. that's right there's some of you here yeah just just finish singing let's let's see what happens next sit down please hmm. let's look at what bible says in jeremiah 17 9 to 10 i want to be slow Jeremiah 17, 9 to 10, he said, teach son, teach them, teach them. 
Jeremiah 17, 9 to 10, he says what? 1, 2, 3, let's read. The heart is deceitful above all things. And he says, desperately wicked. Desperately wicked. Who can know it? Verse 10. I like this. This is where I emphasize. I, I the, Lord, the Lord, search the heart. He searches what? The heart. Your, 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 your suit. No, your sir. chain. No, your eyeglass. Your dance. Your brace. No, your, your falling down. No, your shouting. Your screaming. He searches the heart. Before he hears your voice, he searches your heart. Amen. That's right. Amen. Even to give every man, man according, according my God. I feel the presence ways, of God here. My father. And according, according to the, to the fruit, fruit of, of their doing, doings. your doing is an individual thing, sir. That's why. That's why when I come to church, Pastor David knows I don't look at him. When I'm there and I'm praising God and he even wants to say, Papa, I get so offended. I'll call him back after service. I say, Pastor David, next time when I'm in a service, praising God, don't try. Mercy. Say, nene. Nene. I know you look good. I know you look good. Say, look at your suit all you like. Look at your suit. Say, remind all yourself you like. of your dress, how much it costs all you like. As long as you don't bother me when I'm worshiping my God. That's right. My father. I, the Lord, I search the heart. The heart of a man is desperately wicked. wicked. So I don't look at the appearance. I look at the, the heart. heart, whether it is wicked or it is clean. clean. Pure heart. That's why David said, Oh Lord, purify Beautiful. my heart. Take not the Holy yes. Ghost from my me. Father. Because when your heart is bad, the yes. Holy Ghost cannot stay there. That's right. He cannot come near you. Later, that God. And can I tell you something? No limitation will be broken as a result of that. That's right. Holiness. See, dancer. Thank you, Jesus. I, Lord, I search the heart and I test the mind. That literally means that for God to give us anything, the first thing He looks at the state of your heart, not your voice, not your fall, not your shaking. Not your cry, not your tears, not anything except your heart. Amen. So therefore, do not pray in tongues if you have a wicked heart. <laughs> Some people can pray in tongues in capital letter. Mercy, Lord. I've been to churches where when you pray in tongues, well, they put you at the front. That's right. <laughs> then they That's give right. you a microphone. That's right. So that you can magnify the service. That, 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 so that you can excite some people yeah. who are lukewarm. That's right. Fire when they excite you up. tomorrow, they'll keep exciting you till they right. Because when they excite you, can never be hot. That's right. But when he himself, glory falls on you. That's right. That's Amen. Right. Amen. So for you waiting for people to excite you in any service, wherever you go, it's an error. It's a trap from the pit of hell. That's right. And David encouraged himself, himself in, in the, the Lord. Lord. I don't care what I'm going through. I don't care what is happening in my family. I don't care whether my documents are there or not. I don't care whether the husband is coming or not. Lord, I will give you praise. Amen. Amen. Celebrate Jesus. Proverbs 4, 23. Talk, talk. Keep your heart with all. Some version will say guide it, guide it, guide it, guide it. Because it is what God sees and releases your miracle. Keep your heart with all diligence. For out of it are what the issues of life. Listen, child of God, every time the heavens are open and God releases your breakthrough, it is your heart that receives, receives the breakthrough first before your hands. That's right. It is your heart that receives a miracle. This is spiritual. That's before right. your hands Amen. receive it. Amen. Your heart must receive it. Amen. Your heart is your hands in the realm of the spirit. Amen. That's right. Amen. And from the moment the heart receives a miracle and runs with it, that's literally when it begins to manifest in your hands. Amen. The moment the heart receives it, and even as you go out there, that is when you'll see that problem magnified. Mm. Then you still stand. You say, Lord, I thank you for what you have given me. Because in this kingdom, hey. we thank God before we receive in the world as you give them the thank you right. but yeah we thank God, God before God we receive faith is the substance God of things of God. God. the evidence of things not yet seen please sit down 
Thank you, Holy Ghost. The evidence of things not yet seen. Not yet seen. Say never. Never. Your hands, Your hands only reflect what the heart. Only reflect what the heart have already received. Have already received. If that one is sitting down like a herbal, is turn to the next one. Say ne ne. Anything that your hands have received from heaven, they came from your heart. Because your heart is the hands in the spirit. I prophesied to Sister Grace and Pastor David. I said, Oh, I see a girl. And they were like, No, she says she's not ready, and all that. You see, they had rejected. Another man of God came, is in Therefore, He prophesied as well the same thing. I don't know the man of God. Same thing about a baby. Four people right now. Four people right now. Same thing. But remember once I call her here, I say, your heart is not ready. Amen. I say, your heart is not. As I'm talking now, my, you are pregnant. Oh. Amen. Why? Hallelujah. Their heart is ready. If your heart is not ready, it doesn't matter how they pray for you. Yeah, nothing will happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, sit man. down, sit down. Please. Thank you, Jesus. That's why I keep saying it's not about excitement, no. It is your position in the realm of the spirit. Your heart. Where is your heart position? What is the state of your heart? Hmm. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you, Holy Ghost. If only you know what is coming to you. I'm Jesus. so excited. Hallelujah. Child of God, we know that God is a prayer answering God. I have a book I'm writing, Matters of the Heart. Thank you. Holy Matters Lord. of the Heart. Because I've, I've seen, I've read my Bible and it keeps saying, God is a prayer answering God. Amen. God cannot lie. That's right. But every time I look back, I wonder, why has this one not received? Why has that one not received? Why, God, if you are a prayer answering God, why have they not received? That's right. Matters of the heart, you'll come out this year in the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. You see, prayer answering God, but most time when God releases our blessing, our hearts are not prepared and they are far from God. Yeah. Matthew 15, 8. These people honor me with their lips, but their hearts are far from me. Say, neighbor, is your heart with God? Heart with God. If that one's not responding, turn to the next one. Say, ne ne. Ne ne. What is the state of your heart? What is the state of your heart? I believe and I know that God is ashamed and embarrassed with many of us. The God of heaven is ashamed and embarrassed with many of us. The God of heaven is ashamed and embarrassed with many of us Mercy, because we are still asking for the things he has already released upon us Amen. but we cannot receive them because our hearts are not prepared right. because our hearts are far from him Mercy, Lord. i don't know that this year i came with a caterpillar anointing Amen. whether you like it or not this this year, not this year. Now, I do a lot of things behind the, the, the scenes because I, I'm not there to show anybody anything. But if I settle on your case, you will not rest till you begin to produce those companies. Amen. You will not rest till you get a first class. Amen. You will not rest till everything turns around for your good. Amen. When the Lord turned again the captivity, captivity of David, Amen. they were like them Amen. that pray. It shall be a sudden visitation for your family. Amen. It shall be a sudden visitation for your business. Amen. It shall be a sudden visitation for your ministry. Amen. It shall be a sudden visitation for your children. Amen. If that is you, let your ever sound like thunder. Amen. I prophesy. I receive it. In this month of breaking limitation. Every limitation that has been placed upon your life. Hey, it is broken in the name of Jesus. Hey, I say it is broken in the name of Jesus. Hey, I say it is broken in the name of Jesus. Hey, Anywhere you enter after now. Receive your answers. Receive it. In your business. Receive your answers. Hey, receive it. In your studies. Receive your answers. Hey, receive it. In your career. Receive your answers. Hey, receive it. In the name of Jesus. Hey, Shout, I receive it. I receive it. Someone here, you applied for a mission. 
this month, sit down, everybody. Thank you, Holy Ghost. They have been delaying it. That limitation broken. Okay. Amen. That limitation broken. Amen. I use this to connect with everyone that has made an application that is delayed. Be it immigration breakthrough, be it career breakthrough, be it child benefit, whatever that may be that you have applied. Be it a business, a company. Right now, I release angels in that office and I decree and I declare let your application be released. Amen. Let your application be released. Amen. Okay, do not believe that I project myself in that office. I hold the hand of the angel of this commission. Wherever your application is, I stamp it for approval. I stamp it for approval. Amen. I stamp it for approval. Amen. I stamp it for approval. Amen. I stamp it for favor. Amen. I stamp it for speed. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Sit down, please. Thank you, Jesus. Say neighbor. Neighbor. The answers. The answers are sure from God. Are sure from God. That it is your responsibility. It is your responsibility to prepare your heart. To prepare your heart to receive the answer. To receive the answer. Child of God, every time God releases abundant rain, be it upon a land, it does not matter. If the line is unfettered, nothing will happen. That's right. The land or the ground or the earth. He speaks of your heart. That's right. Amen. Every time God releases a blessing and your heart is unproductive, your heart is wicked, your heart is full of bitterness, it will fall there and nothing will happen. That's right. Mercy, Lord. You know, God was painting the pictures to me that some of you, even when they say this year is a year of and exceeding, exceeding, exceeding glory. Exceeding glory. You know what some of them do? They'll take yeah, their hand. hand. Sit down, sir. Sit down, please. They'll take their hand. Whether it's a pen, they'll take their phone. They'll draw themselves. You know, their apps that draw. And then they'll put rabbit ears on their head. Put rabbit ears. Some of them put horns like demons. Some of them put demonic spectacles. Some of them put their face like memories. Some of them put their faces like wizards. Okay. In contradiction of the word that came for you. That's right. He does not only watches your heart, he weighs your actions. Amen. Say chinere. So you are saying that because I say money is coming to you. Now you are drawing yourself as a poor person. Now you are walking around like a tenant instead of like a landlord. Mercy, Lord. I get upset because many of you are landlords in this land. And you are still walking like tenant. God is disappointed with many of you. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Sit down, sir. Thank you, Jesus. No father, no mother wants to see a child who is not growing. That's right. Even a born baby, a newborn baby, when they are tired of creeping, they begin to walk. walk. When they are tired of walking, they begin to take giant steps. That's right. When they are tired of taking giant steps, they run. Hallelujah. God expects you to grow. Amen. But your heart is not prepared to receive that growth. Mercy, Lord. Help me, Lord. It doesn't matter if they anoint you. Let me anoint you. Turn like chicken and chips. Mm. As long as your heart is wicked and unprepared, I wasted my anointing. That's right. The oil. Sir, Wait. take note. I'll start telling people to pay for the anointing. That's that right. free. Yes, sir. We'll do so. We'll do so. Hallelujah. Mm. Shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Say, Nene, nee, are you still here? So the problem has never been the answers. Because Amen. even as I speak now, there are angels here with babies. There are angels here with keys. Sir. You cannot Sir. see. That's why you are hey. you are, you are My not like that. You, take it, take see. It, you know who they are looking for? Not everybody, sir. They are looking for a heart that is already prepared. There are angels here. I see them with documents. Amen. With contracts. Amen. With house documents. Amen. Is looking at those whose hearts are prepared. Sit down, please. Thank you, Jesus. The problem is not the answers. I feel like crying. You don't know. You don't know. He said to me, Son, I've given you this land, Wolverhampton. And that Amen. everybody who follows his grace will never end a non entity. I've said that about 10 times now. Amen. And I don't mean this kind of lazy following. 
I don't mean this kind of following where you, you reject other areas of your life. I mean a following that you focus on Jesus. But as you focus, every other thing around you comes in line. Amen. Comes in place. Amen. Is perfect. Amen. Mercy, Lord. Problem. It's not the answers from heaven. But the problem has always been your inadequate preparation that has denied you and I access to the manifestation. I'll be shocked again if I ask you, did you pray before you came here? I'll be shocked to ask again, did you pray before you came here? I, I don't mean corporate prayer. I mean personal prayers because everybody can join in corporate prayers but not everyone can stay on their own and pray personally Mercy, Lord. quickly how do you prepare your heart to receive from god because of time now to help us understand this i'm not a bar, bar someone who did bar, i did biology but not at university so i may not get my facts right bear with me what are the components of the heart the heart comprises of veins, arteries, right? Valves and blood and many other things going through it. And if any of this component is disconnected, what happened? Heart failure. Heart, you see that? So in your life, physically, spiritually and otherwise, there must be a balance. That's right. Because if you disconnect from any, what happens? Blessings failure. That will not be your portion in the name of Jesus. Amen. I don't like that. Amen at all. Amen. I don't like that. Amen at all. Amen. What must you do for your heart to be prepared? Like I said, number one, form an image. This ministry, when it started, and I went to be with the Lord, I was in the place of the, a place with God where I went for a three days fast, no water, no food. I wanted to pray for hold that three that three days in in tongues. And as, as I was praying in tongues, he gave me the image. This is five years ago. The image of the logo of the ministry. That's right. Now, I'm just talking among other things. This ministry, he gave me the property. I know when we'll enter the property. Yeah. I know the building. He Amen. said, build me. It is like a finger. The finger of God. That's right. That's, that's the structure we are going to build. Amen. The finger of God. Those images are all there in my icon. Image formation. Amen. Sit down please. Sit down. Thank you Holy Ghost. Sit down. Many of you don't think about anything. You don't create any picture. Look, even if you go for a wedding and you want to get married, don't just go there and sit like, like, like anyhow. Don't just sit nyafu nyafu. Sit there and begin to create color codings. As you are seeing that one getting married, you are saying to yourself, you are forming images of yourself. I'll have four bridesmaids. I'll have best man like this. This is how my own is going to be. This is how my own is going to be. Once the image is there, God will perfect the structure. Amen. Now, let nobody tell you that church is fraud. Let no, it is their experience, not your experience. Don't base your salvation on another person's experience my parents may have failed i don't know what they were doing in church maybe they were just there for eye service but i read my bible and my bible says he's the rewarder of those who diligently seek him Amen. i cannot fail i am anointed to take territories i'm anointed to build territories for jesus i'm anointed to enter every city and take it thank you holy ghost people will come and tell you oh is this god you guys are serving look you might go to every other church word and family ministry is not only genuine it is super genuine amen look 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 listen to me argue with your ancestors that's right argue with ancestors thank you holy ghost thank you holy ghost sit down sir sit down sit down sir that's why you cannot beg anybody if the media person says they are not coming, God will give us a better person. <laughs> if your company employee says they are not coming, God will give you a better, better employee. Person. Amen. A far more better one. That's right. Amen. That's the kind of God I serve. That's right. That's why you don't need to bother who likes you. You don't need to bother because when people have already created images about you in their heart by 
car and give them. Buy houses and give them. They will only look at you depending on their image that they have created about you. That's right. That's right. It will take the Holy Ghost to convict them to change. That's right. That's right. Get it, get it, get it. The Bible says that. And those who are true followers, that even when your friends, even when your neighbors, they reject you, he said, God will bring help from another source. Amen. He said, God will raise strangers so, to bless you. I don't know who is fighting you. After now, strangers will come to your dwelling. Amen. Blessings will come to your dwelling. Amen. Help us will come to your dwelling. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Sit down, please. Oh, you Sit down, please. Oh. Sit down. Thank you, Holy Ghost. <laughs> I, the Lord, search the heart. <laughs> And I test the mind. And I give to every man. So what he gave to your father was according to their work with God. That's right. What he brings to you it's is according, according to your work with God. Hallelujah. It is okay to come from a poor family, but it's not okay to remember. Amen. <laughs> I don't know about you. The electricity my father did not bring in my village. I will bring it there. Amen. Some of you looking at me, the houses, the schools in your village. Let the Holy Ghost empower you to do that in the name of Jesus. Amen. The lines that your parents will not cross. I came with a caterpillar anointing. I push you in the name of Jesus. Amen. I push you over those lines in the name Amen. of Jesus. Amen. I push you over those lines in the name Amen. of Jesus. Amen. If you are the one I'm talking to, let your amen sound like thunder. Amen. Sit down. Thank you, Jesus. There, I, the Lord, search the heart. And I test the mind. <laughs> I said to someone, I said, fight me all you like. Within a few months, you will see word and fire ministry. Amen. Fight all you like. You know what, what I can say about audacity? I have seen it. That's right. And those who fight you, they'll come to your office to ask for help. <laughs> I think you'll say amen to that. Amen. I say, may God give them a problem. That's and may right. the solution be in your hands. Yes. My father. I say, may God give them a problem. And may the solution be in your heart. Okay, you think that's a wicked prayer? The brothers of Joseph fought him. That's right. They said, Is he not a dreamer? What did Joseph do? He saw an image. He went to the brothers and said, I see you bowing down to me. Today, in today's day, they will take a gun and shoot. He went to the father and said, Even though I'm talking to the brother, you're not excluded, father. Even you, you are bowing down to me. Why? Image formation. Did it come to pass? It yes, it, it came, came to, to pass. pass. And I'll keep repeating it. He said, cities will come into where the family Amen. In your job, cities will come in your job. Amen. I said, cities will come in your business. Amen. If your amen is louder, you are the one I'm talking amen. to. Amen. I receive it. Sit down, please. You, Jesus. God does not hear your cry well. First, say, neighbor. neighbor. God is not Igbo. God is not, God is not German. God is not German. God is not Yoruba. Not Yoruba. God is not from Bamenda. God is not from Congo. God is not from. God is not from a Kondo Titi. <laughs> Can I even say God does not hear languages? God yes. Your heart. Your heart. Hallelujah. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. My life is not my own. To you I belong. I give myself. I give myself. I give myself to you. Say my life is not my own. My life is not my own. To you. To you I belong. I give myself. I give myself. you know what you just did if your life is not your own then your life belongs to christ so anybody that fights you your document your children who are they fighting 
and God shall arise. When he arise, arise, what happens? Your enemies are confused. Your enemies are scattered. Amen. I don't know who is he sitting on your job. Oh. I don't know who is sitting on your marriage. I don't know who is sitting on your finances. I don't know who has father. You cannot make it. I came out today with a caterpillar anointing. Wherever they are, I command them to go down for yourself. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ. Sit Thank down, you, please. Jesus. God does not hear Yoruba. God does not hear Cameroon language. God searches the heart before he listens to your voice. It is your heart that determines the preparation of your miracles. So therefore, you cannot ask what you have no image of. God knows you need a child. But what is the image that you have created in your mind, in your heart? I remember a lady came to me and said, Papa, I have not had a child. I've been married 24 years. Mama knows about the story. And I've not had a child for almost, I've not, every time it's miscarriages, it's online, the testimony is online. Every time it's miscarriages, I said, and she's not yet, she's in Nigeria. It is done. She said, just like that. Just like that. First of all, I got her to accept Jesus Christ as a person as Savior and Lord. What is that? Preparation of the heart. It is done. And then after a few months, she called me that. Amen. Uh, it's not happening no. About two months. It's not happening no. And I said, it is already happening. From the moment I spoke it, it is happening. Amen. I said, do this for me. I don't like to give personal testimony. I said, do this for me. Create a room. Now spiritual things are foolishness to a man in the flesh that's right so i'm not talking to everybody that's right <laughs> i said create a room i bought her a pair of shoes i said how many children do you want two i bought her a pair of shoes for the girl because I, I, I don't i can't say i like girls but i like both of them but i like girls yeah. all of us on that <laughs> <We're not laughs> i said create a room hang this shoe on the wall do the bed Every day, that's your prayer room. That's right. Go there and pray. Exactly four months after. Pregnant and confirmed. Amen. Image creation. creation. As she was going in that room, she was creating an image. I said, call their names. Get their names. Call those names every time you pray. Amen. Image creation. Image creation sit down please thank you holy ghost say neighbor neighbor god waits god waits to see the image you create to see the image before he hears your voice before he hears your voice the bible says that god first of all saw the nakedness of adam and eve before he heard their voice god saw a world that was without form Genesis 1. And he created an image of the world he wanted to see. And with that image, he said, The light I saw, the image I'm creating, let and there be light. light. And, and there, there was, was light. light. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And he began to call for all the animals and the trees and the vegetation. If you are here or watching me online and you are still thinking that out of nowhere, more than 2,000 years ago, trees just began to grow. The sea just was created. Things just began to happen out of nowhere. Can I tell you, you are very foolish. Thank you, Jesus. Because our God created the heavens and the earth. He saw what he didn't like and he brought forth what he liked right. by image Creation. formation. And the Bible says you are created in the likeness of God. God. So God. the mockers may say you don't have a child. Hey. Keep seeing your child. That's Still that's keep patting your belly. My God. I keep saying that I'm a quadrillionaire. Okay. Argue with your generation. Oh it is inside Who here, but you cannot see it. But when it's time for me to deliver, you will see it. 
Amen. Then you will not partake in it. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Sit down, please. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Someone came to me. Thank you, Jesus. And said, Pastor, you know, we used to go to Israel a lot all the time. Say, Pastor, why have you stopped going to Israel? I said, Well, the pandemic kind of stopped us. And he keep calling, besting me. Pastor, Israel is now open for everybody. And then I asked him, Son, what is it about Israel? Why do you have this quest to go to Israel so much? What is the image of Israel you have created in your heart? What is it that you want to see about Israel? Huh? And he said to me, Pastor, I just want to see Jesus storm. Hey. I say, you are not my son. You are not my son. Mm. And I said to him, I will send you to Dubai first. Mm. <laughs> I will send you to, to Dubai, Dubai first. Yes. Go and see the sky, skyscrapers that unbelievers have built because of image formation. Yes, I said, by the time you come out of Dubai, there will be anointing that will fall on you. So when you go to see the God of Israel, you will go there and there will be image yes. that will be forming of what you have to do when you come back. You come back. Jesus' tongue may not even be real. That's right. Sit down, please. We, we, sit down. We've been there, right? Sit down. We've been there, right? How many tongues are there? The more than put the microphone in your mouth. So which more one? Is, one. Which one is Jesus? <laughs> <laughs> you see how people are making their money? Mm. Tourism. That's right, that's mm. right, that's right, that's right. And then you, you carry your head. Say, I'm a Christian. I'm a Christian. I'm a Christian. Say I wish above all things that he may prosper, even as I so prosper. So the intention of God for you is to prosper, prosper. not to do tourism. Tourism is good, but every time you go for tourism, begin to look at what you can imagine in your home country. Begin to look at the buildings you can bring down. Begin to draw them as an architect. As soon as you begin to draw them, help us will come to fulfill that. Amen. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Hey, my father. Sit down. Thank you, Jesus. I know the stages of this ministry. Thank you, Lord. I have even seen the bricks that were used for Amen. the 124,000 Sita, Sita Auditorium. Hallelujah. Argue Amen. with your ancestors. <laughs> so they get the leg, so shall it be. I have seen it all. How the bricks will come in. How we'll go <laughs> anoint. <laughs> I've even seen the people here that will go and anoint the land. That's right. He got that they get the leg. Thank you, my father. Please sit down. Please sit down. Jesus. Let me, let me finish this message. My father. Unfortunately, many Christians, they know how to pray. Why is it that Africa prays a lot better, bro? Answer that later on. Don't answer now. It may knock your faith. They fast. They can fellowship. They can go to church. Which is all good. Because God says, do not forsake the assembly of the believer. Say in my house, in my sanctuary. So the sanctuary is not a nightclub. That's right. The sanctuary is not your house. That's right. The sanctuary is the house, house of, of God. God. Amen. They know how to fellowship, but their hearts are blank. God said me their hearts, most of them, their hearts blank like blanket. Blank like blanket. Blank like blanket. Not you, Mercy, not you. It cannot be you. Mercy, Lord. Amen. Not me. He got that ladder. Zero image formation. Zero substance of what they are asking God for. This is why. And I told him, I said, you have to go to Dubai first. And he said, why? And I said, so that when you come back, the spirit of excellence will better your work with Christ. Don't just go to that company and keep wiping poo poo. Don't just go to that company and keep doing the least mediocre jobs. Cleaning companies for years and years and years. And you cannot think with your head that he said you'll be the head and not the tail. That he said you'll be above and not below. That he said you'll be in front and not behind. That he said you'll be the first and not the last. A common man with no certificate is turning you around. He's telling you clean this place is not clean. Yet you spent six years at university. Yet your certificates are in your houses. Thus is almost going on them. Doing nothing why no image formation mercy jesus a yeating man will come to you and he tells you i want to get married to you and you cannot use your common sense and ask him what do you expect in this union for five years 
you are following someone who doesn't even know where they are going. Amen. As long as they don't know where they are going, as long as they have not created an image about this marriage, it means you are heading nowhere. Disaster. If you don't know where you are going, you will not get there. That's right. Sit down, please. Sit down. Quickly. Look at what the Bible says in Genesis eleven six. Let's look at it quickly. And the Lord said, Behold, these people, they have done what? They have, let's read together. And yeah. the Lord said, one, two, three, go. He says what? Behold, the people is one. The and people is what? Is what? One. Carry on. And they have all one language. And this they begin to do. Now, not, nothing is restrained from them which they have imagined to do. Which they have? Imagined to do. E imagine what was their imagination the tower to get to heaven. heaven you know because they imagine god said even more i'm helpless to stop these people <laughs> i'm talking about the one you came here to see <laughs> that's right sir. he said, he said hey. <laughs> he said because these people have imagined it even me god i'm helpless stop them, my father and he thought about it and he to begin to create image in his head <laughs> and he saw how the images created in his head was how they were disunited yes, right. how he obviously con confused their languages yes, right. image yes, right. and when he confused their languages what do their imagination scatter say nene. 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 if you are, can have an image of it if you can have an image of it then you can have it then you can have it you can have it you can have it joseph had an image of it it does not matter what he was going through. He went through the pit. He went through the fire. He went through the hole. He went through false accusation. But what happened? That image remained there. Every time I keep dreaming, I see myself 400 homes. Do I have the money of 400 homes for the needy? I don't. But as long as I keep seeing it, God said to me, and I have drawn pictures of how the 400 homes will look like i've drawn pictures of the restaurants yeah. i've drawn pictures of the hospitals i've drawn pictures of the employee who come and clean i've drawn all those pictures in my head he says son as long as you continue to see those images That's i'll right. bring it to pass amen thank you jesus you don't understand he is the same yesterday today and, and forever. forever say neighbor neighbor if your heart lacks a picture of your future if your heart lacks a picture of your future then it cannot carry the reflection of that future then it cannot carry the reflection say, of nene. Future. Nene. it does not matter if god says you are a millionaire it does not matter it does if, not god, matter says if god says you are free but if you cannot see yourself walking in freedom if you cannot see yourself in the millions then i'm afraid forget the manifestation mercy lord mercy jesus you are preaching to less than 500 people to me i'm preaching to 1 million people hallelujah i give with yourself thank you jesus i give yourself if they are still begging you to come to church or join a unit it is because you have not seen an image of where you are going that's right if they are still begging you to give if they are still begging you to be humble if they are still begging you to be what god wants you to be because you have not seen an image the person who is begging you have seen an image but yet you have not seen an image of where you are going that's right shout hallelujah hallelujah let your hallelujah be louder hallelujah and god began to tell me that many of them have not received their helpers because they have not seen it he said to me son i will make sure millionaires billionaires they come down to your level to make sure the vision is fulfilled amen i had a friend who was a millionaire i've said this story so many times and the lady was like I'll, I'll build the church i'll do all that and i went home i was happy thank you jesus as i closed my eyes he said disconnect from her now subito instanto if you will and i said lord why i thought this was a helper that is coming to make the job easy say son you have not seen helpers say i'll make sure billionaires they come down to your level to take this ministry forward when eh? i don't know 
but I have an image. I have seen the image and I'm walking with that image. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. If you cannot see it, you cannot have it. That's right. Abraham, look. He said what? As far as you can see, I will do what? I will give it to you. I don't go into university to go and have that class. No, sir. It must be first class distinction. Amen. Amen. If you ever hear that I had that class, know that they have exchanged their names. Thank you, Jesus. Some of us, even your scream saver can be a contradiction of what God has said about you. That's right. You want twins, but you are putting a, a ch chicken, chicken. Picture of chicken. Thank you, thank you, sir. <laughs> thank you, sir. You said you will. You want twins, but your, your scream saver is, is chicken. You want to marry a, dis a decent man, but your scream saver, you look like a disco girl. Mercy. And you wonder why your old boys are rushing to you. Because you can only attract your kind. That's right. I have seen a picture of my plane, not your plane. I don't I don't look at your money. I don't touch your money. I've seen a picture of my plane. I did not just see it, I printed it out. Argue with your ancestors. And it comes with hard work. Amen. Paul said, I labor more than you all. Oh. Amen. Hallelujah. Hey, neighbor. <laughs> neighbor. Even your scream saver. Even your scream saver. Should be the next manifestation of your miracle. Should be the next manifestation. Say of your nene. Miracle. Nene. Those pictures on your Facebook. Those pictures on your that Facebook. That does not look like where you are going to. That does not look like As you leave this place. To. As you are going Delete those pictures now. Delete those pictures now. Delete them. Thank because you, a betrayer of what God is talking about you. Yes. Mercy Lord. You know when you go to bed and you begin to watch pornography. A spiritual husband and wife will meet you there. Yeah? That's right. That's right. <laughs> you don't know why they go. When you go to bed before you go the last thing you do matters. That's right. That's if right. Before you go you are seeing yourselves touching your, your ex or someone who you are not married to. You know what is happening. Mm. In the night spiritual husband will, will visit you. That's right. That's, that's right. right. That's right. When you begin to watch all these horror movies, people will pursue you in the night. That's right. We've had testimonies here, right? That's or right. people began to watch fake prophets online. That's, That's right. right. As they watch those fake prophets, the spirit of that fake prophet entered them. Mm. He's here. And That's we right. have to do deliverance again That's right. for them. The people are here looking at me now. That's right. That's it, Jesus. God has always been a prayer answering God. Mm. But the problem is that many pray but do not have a large heart to receive. That's right. They do not have an image of what they expect from God. That's right. I came to an understanding as a run of that Solomon did not receive wisdom. Argue yourself, go and read your Bible. God gave him a largeness of heart Amen. Right. to accommodate all the blessing That's that right. is bringing. Amen. That's right. Amen. That is what brought about wisdom. That's right. Amen. Hmm. I'll continue this on Thursday. We are running out of time. That's right. Should Thank I stop here Jesus. now? Right on, sir. Right Preach on. on Should I stop here? <laughs> right on. Yo, today in this society, you tell someone, I see millions. Instead of them thinking about creating the, the image of the millions in their heart, I, I don't please you. I have never asked you for money and I will never ask you for money. That's, right. That's why I don't even take a salary because I must preach what, what my master wants me to preach. That's right. When I say, you, I see millions, it is coming. But you know what some of them will do? They'll say, Pastor, I think someone told you about it. Now, if you are here, you ever told me something and I came here and prophesied, stand up, let's see you. That's right. That's right. Stand up. Instead of them creating an image in their heart of their millions, they are instead creating images of maybe someone told pastor. Mm, that's right. Me, get, get go down it. to that level. You are a joker. Foundation, sir. Joker. <laughs> Mercy, Lord. Joker. Mercy, Lord. Mercy, Lord. Serious foundation. Serious foundation. Mm. Serious foundation. 
Serious foundation. Mercy, mm. God. Mercy. Shout hallelujah. 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 Uh, and here, before you do warfare, first destroy evil images. That's Amen. right. Before you do warfare, do what? Destroy, destroy evil, evil images. I will prove that to you. Second Corinthians 10, 4, 5. As we run up. It says what? Second Corinthians 10, 4 to 5. God began to show me this this morning while I was preparing my notes. It says what? For the weapon of weapons our, of our, warfare, our warfare, are not, not canal, canal, but mighty, mighty through, through God, God to, what? to the, the pulling, pulling down, down of strongholds. strongholds. And there. So, it, what are the strongholds? Next verse. Who is in the image of verse 5? For the pulling down of strongholds. Casting what? Down, down imaginations. And every, and every high thing, thing that, that exalted, exalted itself, itself against, against the knowledge of God. Stop there. Every high thing that exalted itself against the prophecy that is upon your life. Every high thing that exalted itself against the word of God. Amen. What do you do first? You cast, cast them out down. first. If yes. not, you'll be making a noise and heaven will not be hearing you. Yeah. I give you a fresh word back from heaven. You'll care you yeah. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, my father. It says the pulling down of strongholds, casting down imagination, and every high thing that is not itself against the knowledge of God. So therefore, strongholds are evil imaginations. Mm. Before you kill witches, work on yourself first. That's right. That's right. Hey. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, you are like, ka, 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 ka. your heart is full of bitterness, hatred. There's a sister you don't like even while you're sitting here. There's a brother you don't want to see. Who are you praying for? You are a noise maker. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. There is nobody I don't like more. I've done roadside ministry. I go and I preach to people on the road. Give Amen. them food. Pray for them. I went to a man who had blood running over his nose, over his mouth. I took my hand, cleaned the blood. Thank you, Look Jesus. at how some of them are acting now. Thank you, Holy Ghost. And he was sent out of his house. We heard that testimony here. Yeah? And the council said, you have not been paying your rents. So we take you out. Many of you have been through that maybe in the past. And I said to him, I said, I come in the volume of the book. Amen. <laughs> Thank you, Holy Ghost. And I said, today is Sunday. It was after a service. Mercy, Lord. I said, by Tuesday, mm. they will give you a house. Amen. He said, no possible because they throw my thing outside. They literally chased me out. I have the picture here that I brought once. He was under a bridge with his wife. Mm. It was a winter. Mercy, now, this is Sunday. I said, the council and the same person that thrown you out that's under your application in 48 hours mm. that same person will give you a house amen he said i don't believe so i had to preach to him to prepare his heart to receive this miracle amen, amen, amen. and on monday the council the same person they were looking for him hallelujah they met him under the bridge with food on tuesday they gave him a house hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. What we love you, Jesus. you have imagined. Amen. That's right. Many of you have heard testimony, and I said, Someone said, I'm not traveling. I said, You are traveling. Mm. I said, Just pack your loads. Mama was there once that the person came at home, and he said, I cannot travel because back at home, I'm, I'm wanted. I said, I said, I change your statue. Hallelujah. Like Moses, Hallelujah. from the runner, the wanted yes. to the needed. Amen. That's right. Amen. Hallelujah. And I said, travel. I have spoken. Amen. Amen. They travel, enter the country. Mama is here, and the same records that was speaking against them every time they travel for almost ten years, they enter jejetic. The blood of Jesus washed it away. Amen. Amen. Came back. You heard the testimony here. Came back jejetic. The blood of Jesus washed it away. Amen. Amen. Today, Record all clean. clean. Hallelujah. Image formation. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, my Father. Thank you, Jesus. Hey, Imagination. I don't know. I don't know what is making you think poor. I wish above all things that ye may prosper. I wish above all things that ye may prosper, even be in good health, even as the soul, soul prospered. I don't 
care where they told you you have cancer, you don't have it. Amen. I don't care where they told you you have HIV, you don't have it. Amen. I don't care where they said you have diabetes, you don't have it. Amen. That growth on your body by the power of the Holy Ghost, oh, yes. it dries off now in the name of Jesus. Amen. That growth on your breast, it dries off now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Shout amen like thunder. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Before you will pray against witches, against those that are fighting you, for your miracle, to sit down, you must first of all delete what every negative image. Thank Amen. you, Holy Ghost. That does not look like where you are going. Your ex-boyfriend may have offended you. Your ex-husband may have cheated on you. Your ex-husband, all your present, all your future, whatever it is, may be dating other women. They may be drinking alcohol. <laughs> it does not matter. See a, an image of what you have, you want. Amen. And then as they drink alcohol, drink the Bible. Bible. Hey, yes. Hallelujah. Before doing warfare, you must delay those thoughts that tell you that you cannot make it in the UK. Those thoughts that tell you that you cannot have a job without interview. We've seen it here. You cannot have a job without a, a, a making an application. You cannot have a job without a, 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 a work history. A nonsense. Nonsense. My God is the one that created the heavens and the earth. He says he holds them in the palms of, of his, his hands, hand. including your employer, That's including right. the home office, That's including right. the doctors, That's including right. anywhere That's your application right. is. Amen. He can turn it wherever he will. That's Amen. right. Amen. This week, someone hearing me, God will give you a shocking testimony. Amen. God will give you a shocking testimony. Amen. God will give you a shocking testimony. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Sit down, please. Psalms 45, verse 1. My heart hmm, is indicting a good matter. Yes, he may have hurt me. Yet, yes, she may have hurt me. But I know who I am. I know where I am going. Amen. I know what is coming to me. I see my helpers coming. I see my husband coming. Amen. I see my business coming. Amen. I see my first class coming. Amen. I see my money coming. Amen. I see my immigration breakthrough coming. Amen. I see my driving license Amen. coming. Amen. I see Amen. everything that God has ordered for me Amen. coming. Amen. Someone, you are hearing the sound of my voice. Amen. Those unfinished Amen. projects receive grace to finish and by fire. Amen. Receive help us to finish and by fire. Amen. Receive grace to finish and by fire. Amen. If you are the one I'm talking to, let your amen sound like thunder. Amen. Thank Sit down. You Jesus. I started, we started building a, a, a massive skyscraper. We did not know where the money would come from. We wanted to start in 2018. And God said no. Say you will start it in 2019. Say obedience. Obedience. And I said, Lord, this is an opportunity for a land. Obedience. Let's start. And I said, no. 2019. I'm making everything available. Amen. He said, just think it. And I sent, in 2019, he began to bring the funds. That's right. And I sent the design to an architect. And my brother and the rest are saying, can you finish this building? I thought you said they don't pay you. I thought you said you, you, don't, you don't receive anything from church. I thought you said you don't know anything about church finance. I say yes, I don't receive anything. I don't know anything about church finance. But at least I know where my help comes from. Hallelujah. Right? I, and I'm saying skyscraper with all humility. Amen. As Amen. I speak to you, I don't know where the money came from. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. I don't know where it came from. Almost finished. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. You know why? I saw it. I drew it. I gave it to them. Amen. As long as you see it, you draw it, you give it, the carpenters begin to align themselves. Yes, the right. bricklayer. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Thank you, Holy Ghost. I was not called to waste people's time. Amen. No, sir. I was called to bring out that embedded gift in the inside Amen. of me. Amen. Amen. You, you are not who they say you are, sir. That's right. That's right. You are who he says you are. Amen. That's right. Amen. You must stand on that image of you. Amen. He said, for they are a royal priesthood, a holy nation. nation. He has called them to do what? He has called them to do what? To show so for my God. God, you don't show, understand. Ma, if the best cars are coming out, you are the one to receive them. Amen. If the best houses are coming out, you are the one to receive them. Amen. Amen. But until you see it, it will never happen. happen. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. 
Thank you, Holy Spirit. Sit down, sit down, please. Sit down, please. Thank you, Jesus. And here, Philippians 4, 8. Finally, brethren, whatsoever things are true, whatsoever things are pure, whatsoever things are honest, whatsoever things are just, whatsoever things are pure, whatsoever things are lovely, whatsoever things are of good report, if there be any virtue, and if, if there, there be, be any praise, praise think, think on, on these, these things. things. Think of what? These things. Imagine those things. Hallelujah. Imagine the husband. That's right. Or imagine the wife. That's I said right. and I'll say again, in this country, you can live in a house all paid for. Amen. You see how your amen has rejoiced? Amen. Say the land is yours. The field is yours. The seed is yours. Everything I have given it to, to you. you. Don't you read your Bibles? But it is not for everybody. It's for those who can see it. Hey. That's right. Wherever you are, just begin to thank God. Ask for God, mercy because God, some of us, I say God is embarrassed. God, God is not happy God. with many of us. It's God, not the will of God that you should be broke. Yes. It's not the will of God that you should Have be where you are. mercy, Jesus. Ask God for mercy for harboring filthy Have thoughts. mercy, my Father. For harboring filthy thoughts that has brought about limitations. Yes, Lord. Ask Him for mercy. In any way, for I have limited myself. Thoughts. In any way, I have to limited wash your myself mind and your my heart with the blood of Jesus. Have mercy upon Father, me. Father, sanctify Jesus. my thoughts. Have mercy, Lord. Father, have sanctify mercy. my thoughts. Have mercy, Jesus. Take away negative thoughts have from mercy, my mind. Lord. Put in clean have thoughts. Mercy upon he said, I'll give you a mercy, fresh Lord heart. Jesus. I will give you a new heart. He says, heart. I'll take away the heart have of stone. Mercy, I will have give heart. you a heart of flesh. Lord, give me a new heart. Jeremiah said, Oh, Lord, give me a new heart. Oh Lord, Lord, give me a new heart. That only sees those things that are you. Have mercy upon us. Have mercy, Lord. And break up every limitation. Have mercy upon us, Jesus. In every way we have limited ourselves. Lord, show us mercy. Show us mercy. Because we are breaking forth this morning. Because we are breaking forth once more. Give us a new heart. Have mercy upon us. Give us a new heart. Have mercy upon us. Give us a new heart. Have mercy upon us. Have mercy, Jesus. My sin name, name we are praying. Amen. Amen. Now, the Josh shall live by, by faith. faith. Create that mm. image now. Amen. Now, create it. That image of that job, why are you looking at me? Create it. That image of that business, create it. That image of that husband, create it. That image of that first class degree, create it. That image of anything you are trusting God for, create it. Open your mouth, create it. Create it, create that image of the wedding. Create that image of the project completed. Create that image of your helpers. Create that image of your family restoration. Create that image of you being totally free. Create that image of your documents being released. Create that image of your promotion coming out. Create in me a clean heart, O Lord. I renew a right spirit within me. Create in me a clean heart. Renew a right spirit within me. Cast me not away from your holy presence. And take not your holy ghost from me. But restore the Lord back unto me. The joy of your salvation. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Jesus' name we pray, my Father. Amen.
what I've just done by the spirit of the living God. Amen. I've now created a stage for you to go back and run with that world. Amen. If you don't run with it, think anything you want, nothing will happen. That's right. That's church. The answers, they don't come from me. They come from him. Amen. But he uses me or any other pastor as a vessel to create that atmosphere. To create that place, that platform for you to go now back and Amen. you are you are imagining these things. Amen. And as you are imagining, you are running with them. What do I mean by you are walking for them to come to pass? Amen. And when you do that, no devil can stop you. Amen. Recently, he said to me, "Son, build me a three thousand auditorium in Cameroon. This one we are not three thousand. Build me, <laughs> build me a three thousand auditorium in Cameroon. Does that not sound like foolishness? But if he makes sense." then God did not speak to you. That's right. Because as long as it comes from God, it does not make, make sense. sense. Let's share the grace. With the, the grace, grace of, of our Lord, Lord Jesus, Jesus Christ, Christ, the love, love of, God, of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely God's goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives and we shall dwell in the presence of the Lord forever and ever. Amen.